Everybody and welcome to my channel from the desk of Antoinette Smith in this video I'm going to show you what my twist out looks like so I'm gonna start just by um, untwirling each individual twist being careful to not um, make too much frizz now sometimes people will suggest that you put oil on your fingers so that you don't have too much frizz, but um, I don't want any more oil in my hair at this point. My eyes tend to water up too much if I have too much of it. So basically the day before I had a twist out, or sorry, a twist, and then at night I just put a cap over it to protect it. Some of the ends could have used um, a roller at the end, but it was fine without it. As you can see, some of that, the bottom of my hair is a little bit straighter than curly. It'll be fine though. One of these days I'm gonna have longer hair to uh, twist out. I have some cool um, board pictures on my Pinterest board already of some cute twist outs. And it's all about um, how you part your twist and which direction you have them laying. So I'm still very new to this. almost done so I'm still getting used to this ear to this picking it out I've never worn a twist out in public yet because I've never felt like that it actually looked good enough to wear out in public um, my son's girlfriend Jada shout out to Jada she recommended that I kind of start with the roots of the hair to add the volume and so that's what I'm going to do when I focus on the roots, it helps me to not have too much frizz. But so far, I really like the way this is looking. And um, would have no problem going to work like this. Matter of fact, I love this just as much as wash and go. So thanks for watching.